What is that? Uh, speak on to me. Smooth thing. Uh, uh, I said a 30. Yeah. I, I said a 30. I think 11. Yeah. Speak on to me. Smooth thing. Like the brother was saying, they want to hear live. Mm -hmm. Uh, Isaiah 30 and 10. Right around there. Yes. Yeah. Isaiah 30 and 10. Which say unto the seers, see not, and, pro and to the prophets, prophesy unto us, unto us, uh, un prophesy not unto us right things, but speak unto us smooth things, prophesy deceit. Uh -huh. So what he, what that, what the, what the guy that he was uh, breaking the scripture down to, he wanted to hear a lie. He didn't want to hear the truth, man. If you'd have told him a lie, he would have accepted it, man. Saying everybody can make it, he would have accepted what you said. But that's the way. That's the ways of uh, uh, of this society. The way it was built, man. It was based on lies. So he was raised in the schools and going to them churches and and receiving lies. So that's what he trusted in lies, man. You see, and when you tell the truth, you just been ruining his whole day. <laughs> you just it. shattered everything, that's right? Man. Make it up phone and yeah, yeah, yeah. They into it with you. Yeah. You know. He told me I was preaching hate. Yeah, see that? Yeah. But see, uh, all right. <laughs> all right, he don't know what, he don't know what, you know what I want. Get that right out. Oh, you got it. Ecclesiastic. Hey, right, he don't know what season we in, man. You know? Okay. Ecclesiastic, I got it, I got it. Right. It says, uh, Ecclesiastic 3 and, uh, 3 and 8. It says, a time to love, a time to hate, a time to, of war, and a time of peace. Mm -hmm. So what time are we in? War. war. Man, this war and hate, man. Ain't no peace. Ain't no peace coming to America, man. Ain't no peace coming to our people on this side. It's war and hate, man. You see? And the scriptures plainly tell you, and uh, like the brother was saying, uh, like the brother was saying, when he was talking, he he was the guy was saying that he was preaching hate, right? But it tell you plain today in Romans 9 and uh 13, it says. For, for it is written, Jacob have I loved, but Esau have I hated. But really, he was concerned about the so-called white man. Huh. You see, the guy that he was speaking to, because they never, our people never asked about them Africans over there. They never asked about the Chinese or the, or the Japanese. They never asked about all the other nations. They be concerned about this so-called white man, man. Yeah. You see, and they don't even know uh, uh, the white man biblical nationality, man. Like he was saying, he unlearned, man. This uh, Romans 9 and uh, 9 and uh, 13, as it is written, Jacob have I loved, but Esau have I hated. And that's plain, plain man. Mm -hmm. You can't get around that. But that's why we're reading over uh, uh, Zechariah 13 and 8. Zechariah 13 and 8. God. And it shall come to pass that in the land, say of the Lord, two parts therein shall be cut off and die. 66.6% .6 of the nation of Israel. Just cause you don't want to, hey, the hand is reaching out to you. You want you don't want to grab hold, man. Take hold. So it's gonna be death and destruction to you. What? It says, but the third shall be left therein. It said the third shall be left therein, and one third gonna make it. The elect, and the elect, the hundred forty-four thousand in the multitude, man. They gonna make. It. You know? Yeah. And he said, this is Zechariah, this is Zechariah 13 and 9. And I and I will bring the third part through the fire, and I will refine them as silver is refined, and I will try, I mean, and I will try them as gold is tried. God, and that's what he's doing now. We out here on the highways and byways, right? This is a trial right here. This is us being in the fire because you got scoffers that'll come up. You got cops that'll come up. They try to disrupt this word. You got, like you said, you being tried with your with your, uh, your, your your people you know back home. They telling you you crazy and shit. You know, they are, you preaching hate. That's part of you coming through the fire. You know, we're going to be tested. And then we're going to be tested in that time of martial law also. When them, when them troops come, that's going to be a fiery trial too. So we're going to be tested in that time also. So if you got the name in and you believe in the name, you keep calling on that name, and you're part of the elect, you how about you now going to bring you through that fire. And you're going to be refined. You're going to, hey, it's a possibility you can have them spiritual powers, man. In the end. Then you get the red shot. You know? What it's going to be. You know? They going to see real hatred in that day. That's right. You know what I'm saying? I got one. It's Psalm 66. 
and 66 and 10. It says, For, for thou, O power, has proved us. Thou has tried us as silver is tried. And when you look that word proven up right there, it's a Hebrew word, uh, bakan. It means to be examined, to be tried, to be scrutinized. So if you ain't being scrutinized and tried, then you better look around and see, damn, am I in the truth? Because right. when you're in this truth, man, you're going to catch hell. That's part of being in the truth. You're going to catch a lot of hell, man. You know? Some brothers might catch hell more than others. Because we know as your spirit grow, your spirit grows and grows, hey, it's more different kind of demons that come That's at right. you. Right. You know? This uh, 2 Corinthians uh, 4 and uh, 17. For our light affliction, which is but for a moment, worker for us as far more exceeding, exceeding, exceedingly, an eternal weight of glory. God, so this is really like a light affliction, man, we're going through. You know, it's, it's real, it's light. But seem to be heavy to us, but it's really a light affliction. And we're going through it so we can obtain what the, the glory, man. Uh, 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 the kingdom, man. That's what we in this for. You know, it's not no, not no play game and shit. You know, think we out here just doing this for nothing? Like the brother said two weeks ago, there's a lot of things we could be doing, but this is what this is. This is our, this is our main job, man. We was just explaining to the other guy what, what we go out there for Esau. That's a, that's a part time job. This is full time. That's what we in this for. That's right. Trying to obtain the kingdom, bro. Second Corinthians uh, 4 and 18. While we look not at the things which are seen, but at the things which are not seen. Come. For the things which are seen are temporal. God. This, but, yep. but the things which are not seen are eternal. What you looking around, this shit is this shit is temporary right here. Because all this shit gonna be blowed up. We looking for the things we can't see, you know, a chariot ride, the kingdom of heaven. Yeah. You know, being able to uh, possess slaves and, and, and have, you know, enjoy our families and stuff. We can't see that right now, but that's what we're looking for. You know, we're not looking to really have no 2017 charger and all that shit. We ain't no, looking for that shit, no, man. No. We ain't not looking for that kind of shit. We ain't looking for the next concert to go to, none of that, man. We trying to seek, you know, how about shimmy out shy? Hey, and just do what we supposed to do, man. Do our job so we can get out of here, man. Okay. This first John. Like that shit right there. See that, that nigga right there? He riding in a damn, I don't know what that shit is. Rolls Royce. Uh, Rolls Royce, Bentley and shit. See, he he's seeking the shit of this earth, man. Yeah. He looking for the next car wash or the next bitch he can get with that car. Yeah. You know? Um, yeah. You know, they eat a pity me where all Jakes want to be right there. Right. You know, he right. think he he think he right with the so-called white man right now, not knowing they got a death stick waiting on this goddamn man. Right. Yeah. Do the power how about Shemiro Shad, man? This uh, First John four and uh, five, they are of the world. He is of the world. He's looking for the hoes. He's looking for money and shit. Cause now he got to chase after money to maintain right. that damn car. Cause if he got to change his damn uh, uh, spark plugs yeah. or oil, he got to he got to have probably four or five hundred dollars. So he he right. he of the world, man. Go ahead. Yeah. They are of the world. Therefore spake they of the world, mm -hmm. and the world heareth them. God, see, now if he come up to a Jake, a two thirds Jake, and tell him, hey man, this is how you get your game up. He gonna listen cause he looking at a worldly Bentley and shit. He want to have a Bentley so he can look good for the neighborhood and the damn bitches and shit. But yeah, we trying to tell brother, hey, this is the way that you obtain salvation. Not get your ass killed in the end, they gonna walk right by. Cause we ain't looking like him. You no, know, we ain't got fancy jewelry on. We ain't rolling no fat ass cars. So they not gonna look at us the same way. They gonna be like, oh, y'all don't know shit. Y'all, we don't know shit. We ain't, we ain't getting, we ain't, uh, not getting uh getting money yeah you see getting money which uh that's not gonna help you in the day of uh in the day of uh wrath man and it tells you right here biggest day 
if he was uh, if he was if that guy was learned, he would know what he doing is straight bullshit. This uh Zephaniah one in uh eighteen. Neither their silver nor their gold shall be able to deliver to deliver them in the day of the Lord's wrath. Mm, see, so that little Bentley he rolled by, that probably a cell phone he got, he probably paid a grand for it. They ain't gonna be able to deliver his ass. It ain't gonna day. work. It ain't gonna work. You know, the most high gonna have the ball joints break on that motherfucker anyway. Right. You know, it's, it's gonna be. But the but the whole land shall be devoured by fire. God, thermonuclear destruction. That's what we looking for. Of his jealousy. Of his jealousy, man. The Lord, Lord is mad at these damn niggas, man. He's mad at these other nations. But yet, it's a trick bag because they think he love them. You know? It's beautiful. Go ahead. For he shall make a, he shall make even a speedy riddance of all them that dwell in the land. Come speedy riddance. In one hour, man, the scriptures say, this place is going to be laid flat. One hour. You know? And it's going to be beautiful, man. I mean, it's, it's just like, our salvation is dearer than when we first believed, bro. I mean, it's right around, the, we like, we this far from, from the kingdom of heaven, man. It's like right here. It's here, man. Any day now, we can wake up and it be it be on and popping. That's right. You know, when I wake up in the morning, I be like, first thing I say, you know, Brock Thai How, Brock Thai How, Shy, you know, try to say that when I wake up. Then I be like, shit, I'm still here. You know, it's like, got to get up, play this fucking bullshit game yeah. for another 20, 16 hours or 20 hours until I can go to sleep again. You know, so it's, it's, it's fucked up. I right, look up this look up this word consolation in uh in Luke uh, six and twenty four. Luke six. But woe unto you that are rich, for ye have received your consolation. Con. The word consolation that comes from the Greek thirty eight seventy four. The Greek word is uh parak lasis. Parak lasis. Paraclesis, paraclesis, that's it. Uh, it means um, comfort, consolation, exhortation, uh, blue letter. It says uh, consolation, comfort, that which affords comfort or refreshment. Yeah, that's your refreshment. That's your mm -hmm. comfort right there. Being able to drive that car and think you think you winning, mm -hmm. you know? Think, think this is this is the way of life, man. You see, when it's all gonna be wiped out, it's all temporal, man. You know, this kingdom, this kingdom that so-called white man is uh is a uh, uh, ruling right now, it's temporal, man. You see, and when you're trying to put all your energy in on a uh, uh, materialistic game and and chasing after these uh, uh backwards uh mind thinking women. You don't get destroyed, and you already receive your consolation because that's the main reason why you get money is to have women flock to you. But not knowing, you being ignorant, not knowing when you got money like that, you got people that's always scheming on you because that's what money bring in this society, schemes. You see, so you ain't bringing nothing more and more. That's all you're doing to bring more and more problems to yourself. That's what you're doing. Ignorantly, not even knowing. But this is what the scriptures say, and this is what Yahweh Shah said. Luke 6 and uh, 24. But woe, meaning destruction, destruction. God. unto you that are rich, mm -hmm. for ye have received your consolation. Mm -hmm. You see? Right. Woe unto you that are full, mm -hmm. for ye shall hunger. Woe unto you that laugh now. He laughing now. He was laughing when he rode by. You couldn't see them with all them damn gold teeth in his damn mouth. Go ahead. It says, but woe unto you that laugh now, for ye shall mourn and weep. God, it's gonna be bad uh, lamentations on him, man, in the end, man. He gonna, he gonna be crying, man. That's right. Like the scripture said, he gonna, he gonna, his heart gonna fail, man. He gonna cry, man. <laughs> he gonna cry. <laughs> oh, man. You know, we are gonna be right there to put that sword on his neck. That's tell right. him, go on, kill yourself, nigga. Follow him. <laughs> Follow him. <laughs> That's what it's going to be. <laughs> so if I got to raise my hand and chop the dick off, you ain't going to like it. <laughs>